Well, I fucking hope this isn't focused. It's Friday. Friday night. Uh, it's 9.26. I'm still in my scrubs. I literally just came back to 38.48.5 to get some clothes for tomorrow morning. I gotta take a shower and then I'm leaving again. But I realized that I hadn't shot anything for Vlogtober today at all uh, because I worked all day. And after I worked, I went and walked a dog. And then after that, <laughs> I went and took Allie to... And then after that, and then after that, I came here. So it's almost 10 o'clock. I haven't eaten dinner. I planned on doing like an MTV cribs type of thing for my uh, apartment and I wanted to clean up <laughs> my room but I mean in all honesty it, that vlogtober is about what realism I guess and I would be lying to you if I said that my place was clean at all times so I'm just gonna have it be in the background as is with my box fan, my other fan, and the piles of clean laundry on my bed and my open drawers because that's how I live 24-7. Um, yeah, it's Friday night. I'm 27 years old and I'm fucking tired. I'm so tired. I want to uh, go to bed, actually. Uh, today, today I bought a new pillow and I'm hoping that it's gonna help me sleep better. I haven't been sleeping well at all and it's been months. And I'm sure part of it is because I'm fat and I'm sure there's some sort of like back problem, something like that. But I just, like I can't reset my body clock and even on the weekends when I don't have to work, I get up early. So I'm hoping maybe a new pillow <laughs> will help in some way. The colder weather is gonna help too because it gets kind of hot down here, which is why I have two fans. So that's where I am right now. You know, and there's the stereotype that I should be living it up. You know, I should be partying or what have you, getting drunk, which don't get me wrong, I had beer, <laughs> where's my beer? And I would love nothing more than to uh, tie one on right now, but I have what is called responsibilities. And you know, as you get older, you can't get drunk every October night or weekend for that matter. I have to get up tomorrow early before I go to work and I'll wake up at someone else's house and I'll <laughs> And then I'll go to work. And I only work till one, granted, because it is a Saturday. But still, I don't like to feel like shit at a job that I love to do. So no, I'm not going to be out getting drunk tonight. Maybe tomorrow night. Who knows? I don't have to work Sunday. <sighs> Whatever. I'm just, I'm so fucking tired right now. Um, so I'm gonna make dinner in my microwave. I'm gonna make some corn, because that's all I want. I just want a fucking can of corn. There's a fucking can of corn right here. And I'm gonna put some butter in it, and I'm gonna put some fucking seasoned salt in it, and I'm gonna heat it up in this motherfucking microwave like I'm the fucking Tom Colicchio of basement living. And while I'm doing that, I guess I will, like, show you around and stuff. So, <laughs> here's my apartment. Right behind the camera is the front door. There's my bed. Like I said, box fan, other fan. This here is my food collection. And this is where I keep my underwear, socks, and sleep shirts. If you look really closely, you'll see that I don't have a ceiling. <laughs> So, which I think is kind of cool. I don't really care if I have a ceiling. As long as I have four walls and a bed, I don't really care where I live. All right, so we were talking about that corn I'm gonna make earlier. It's right over here, right by where the magic happened, which is here, which is here, which is here. And by magic, I mean reading lots of books and not sleeping. I've lived down here for five months. And I like it. It's nice. It's quiet. And obviously I can be as much of a fucking slob as I need to be. I gotta drain my corn. I gotta drain my corn before I cook it. So I guess I'll take the camera into the bathroom now. Do you know that constant internet debate where people are like, the toilet paper goes one way. Oh, you're wrong. It goes this way. It, this is the only way that it goes. And you just, you put it on top. And that way, there's no debate. Whichever way you want to unroll it, it's ready for you. Now let's drain some corn. So good. Get a close-up on that. Okay, so I think if I start recording from here, I've captured all the angles. There's the other side of my room. That's the front door I was talking about there. And I found this at the store at Walmart. <laughs> I got so excited. It's one of those bags where you hold more plastic bags. Here's my two bookshelves, my pride and joys. I have another one over here, but these are the ones that hold the bulk of my book. Over here is the closet. There's no door on it, but I don't really give a fuck. Because what do I need a door for? When I fucking literally keep every goddamn piece of clothing I wear on my fucking bed. I'm a goddamn disgrace. I'm okay with that though. I'm fine with it. I don't know about the rest of you, but I can't wait 
to embrace living as a spinster with 92 different cats. Uh, I got about two minutes on this cord. <laughs> Let me pop these fans on. It's probably gonna be a little bit loud in here now. That and the ambiance of the microwave running, I'm sure is really making this an A-plus video. So this has been my MTV Cribs episode. See above here on my box fan? It's a container of raisins. I have to keep it on the box fan so that the box fan doesn't rattle around at night. That's it, that's all I got. Oh, my coin's done. Seize the salt the shit out of this. Paula.